people, today I come to you with a Timu haul. Now this haul, the last one package that I received in, it was two orders in one. So what I did was I separated, I separated all the moulds. And this is what this haul is. It's all the moulds that I bought in the two purchases. That is gorgeous. This is a little um, tea light holder. But that just looking at it like this, this is gorgeous. I really like this. Very pretty. Very pretty. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take all the cellophane off. I think. Nah. I'll lift it on that. Our next item. It's the little mushroom house. That is cute. That is really cute. I've been making the little jar. I made this one, but then I yanked it up when I was trying to take the bottom and make it smooth. So this one's mine. But I really like how this one turned out. I made it the, the purple going into the white and then white lid and then I made it again in just the white but not so white white so this is more like a frosted white but it, I, I think they're really pretty I think they're really pretty so I can come away for that mould now and start making other stuff. This my daughter's into spills and I thought I could make her maybe some earrings out of these. But that's a skull. Again, it's just a little jar and it comes with a little lid. This loops way bigger. on the picture. Way bigger. But it'll work because I'll just make possibly I'll make um, a gibbet for my crocs. 
Yep, yep. Yep, yep. Really, I shouldn't be buying all these because we've, um, we've just had notice to quit our flat. Um, so yesterday I was in quite a state. It's, it's not the fact that we're having to move, it's the moving. Um, I'm getting myself all worked up about it. And yeah, physically, I can't do a lot. So yeah, we'll see what happens. What is it? Oh, this one. This, again, I got for my daughter. I seen Steve McDonald do this. And it looked amazing. Um, he just, the snake he did with gold. And the skull itself, I think he did in black. And I think my daughter would love this as an ornament. So, that's why I got that one. This one I got for me because I love lizards. Can anybody tell me, this is actually a gecko, I think. Can anybody tell me, I want to make one of these to put in my car. Now, I know that the inside of the car gets really hot. So my question is, once it's cured and cured properly is it okay to put it in the car like that would be on my dashboard so would it be okay to keep this in my car or will it melt is my question because i would like to make one for my car but i wouldn't like to go out there and find it melted all over my dashboard that would be a mess. So, yeah, that one's for me. A sip of the coffee. Our next one. Why have I got another skull? A skull. I don't know why I bought another skull. But we have another skull. is the three pack of pens. Now I've already got I've already got this one. And that makes this Yep, that makes that one. So, Southern Lady, this is how it turns out. I've got an air bubble here. <gasps> but, yeah, I don't really like the square one. So I've now got two square ones, but I wanted it for the rounder ones. So I bought the set of three. Next is the alphabet. I've got the small alphabet, um, but I wanted it for making key rings. So 
that to our gel for a bit. The next one. This was supposed to be like a jug, I think. Why has that got? This was, I think it was a jug and you got cork lids that sat on top. I think that's what that one is. This one is the heart key ring in two halves. So I'm going to make some of these and give us gifts. Next one, I don't know why I bought these. But I did. I think this is just a triangle eating mold. Next one is skulls. Again, don't know why I bought it. I need to stop going on here at late at night. This one is... Wow, well, they look tiny. It's like, do you know how you get the... Um, like the Chinese coins and it's got like the jade button? That's what this shape is. I expected them to be maybe a time and a half that size. Next is more alphabet, but it's Um, like cursive writing. That's quite nice. It'd be nice to make like a necklace, say like a, a necklace with the whole name. I'll get this one first. This is another, like a tea light candle voltive holder. Um, but it's got like the little, the little dimples. Again, I was thinking I could do this in clear resin and then use the little, um, rhinestones that I got in the last haul and put them into the wee squares. So, yeah, that could be an idea. And our last item for today is the domino mode. Mode? Mode? Mode. It looks okay. I've had this in, a, in and out and in and out and in and out my cart. Um, 
Yeah. So that's the domino mold. So that's our haul for today. Say thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Hit that subscribe button for me, please. And the like button. And we'll see you all again soon. Ta-ta for now. Thank <laughs> you.